Good afternoon, everybody. My name is Fritz Octav, and I am a member of Makone, which is a Haitian organization, and we are trying to make the community stronger. I would like to talk quickly about two things. The first thing is about all the lies and everything that the, 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 the I will say, I don't know, the, the right wing of the Republican Party has been spreading out. What we want to say is that, unfortunately, the Haitian community, we are engineers, we are doctors, yes. we are lawyers, yes. we are bus drivers, yes. we are everywhere. Yes. So it's a fact that we are helping with the economy because we are paying taxes and everything. Now, Mr. Trump, I have one message for you. Psychology, a lot of people have been saying that it's much easier for somebody to love than to hate. Why do you have to work harder? Why do you want to hate instead of love? Everybody, could you help me say love is the answer? Love is the answer. Love is the answer. Love is the answer. Thank you. And for my Haitian community, I want to tell you that what we have to do now is to go out in November and to vote. Thank you. Thank you so much. So I'm going to introduce you, Marjorie Bernardo. Uh, from the Haitian American United Incorporated, but yes, I'm asking is that Jeff from INE is here? Please join me next. Someone guess Jeff. Jeff from INE for me. That will be our next speaker after Marjorie. Well, I'm sure everyone can hear me. Yes. Can everybody hear me? Yes, yes ma'am. Listen, HAU, Haitian Americans United, this is why we are here. We are here to support the dream, and we are here to support the community. I'm an Haitian American. I will always be a Haitian. I will always be an American. Our vote counts. Yes. In this country, you cannot have a family member in a nursing home for, for that person not to be taken care of by Haitian persons. Yes. We contribute in every sense of the word. What we want to say is diversity is strength. I see the sign in the back, and that's what we are. Immigrants make this country great. Yes. And if we want this country to remain great, to continue being great, we all need to step up, step up and vote. Yes. Vote yes. for the best thing. Vote for us not to hear nonsense. It doesn't matter where you come from. Discrimination is discrimination. If you keep silence, if you keep, if you don't say anything, you are part of the problem. And we don't want to be part of the problem. We want to be part of the solution. So let me say. Together we are stronger. Yes. Together we are stronger. And if you have not yet registered to vote, get moving because we got to vote. Yes. And if you have families down by Florida where there's a lot, a lot, most of the Haitians, you better call them, make that phone call, tell them that they need to register, they need to have their voices heard for peace and for non-discrimination yes this community as you guys can see we have representatives in every part of mass yes we are represented we are senators we are doctors we are everything yep. so we stand for something and we have our deputy superintendent crispin of the Boston Police Department that is right now. I don't know if you guys been watching the news, but right now he he what we want him reinstated. Yeah. Yes. Right now he is down Charlestown, not representing the community. So I ask you guys, make your voices heard, make your voices heard everywhere. We are passing out these flyers. Take a look. Sign up, go take a look.
because the Boston Police Department said that they are for community, community policing. Community policing means that they need to represent the community. And if you are such a person who is working for the enhancement so that we all have equality and we are treated fairly by the police department, we need someone who knows what it's like to be there. Yes. So I ask you guys, vote, 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 sign the petition. Hello, hello. Hello, hello.